Hello everybody, Samanian here, and today we're back with another video. Today I'm going to be reviewing the, or at least doing a partial review of the Matter Overdrive mod. So let's get into it, shall we? First things first, you may be wondering what this, or who this weird little guy is here. This is the mad scientist junkie. That's right. He's like, I don't deal with humans. And you could be either, I'm in a hurry and I gotta get out of here, or I want to be an android. Finally, getting rid of that fragile body is the best choice. The only problem is I need you to bring me a set of android parts before we begin. And you could be like, I don't care. Alright, and then we could be like, see you later. Oh, no, I can't even look at you. So fragile. Alright, and we could be like, see you later, weirdo. Anyway, we get a little tablet from that little thing here, the scientist data pad. So you can actually look at everything that's in the mod here. Like your batteries, we have the basic battery, which holds that much energy. Which I think is like... I don't know, actually, so I'm not even going to start spitting out numbers. Then we have the one that is like 1.5 million. I think that's like half of that, so that's like 500, or yeah, 500,000. And then we have the unlimited creative battery. So anyway, I don't have to act. Whoops. I don't actually have to read all this, really. All right, so we can go to weapons now. There's a lot of parts and stuff here. But we're going to review all that, so we're not going to actually get into that right now. Anyway, first things first, I want to become an android, right? Ah, uh, so we got a bunch of parts here. We have either a melee android or a ranged android. You get your little titanium, or tritanium spine here. Alright, so we can take that one, or there's a quest. Or I'm not actually going to get into the quest right now. Because if so, that would take a while. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and gather the arranged android parts. Right, so we go back to them now. We have all the parts we need. No, I can't even look at you. So fragile. I'd be like, I wanted to be an android. Finally, getting rid of that fragile body is the best choice. The only thing, only problem is I need you to bring me a set of android parts before we can begin. And you'd be like, I have all the parts. And now we can start being changed. Look at that. It's pretty cool because now it's constructing neural pathways. Neural configurations and progress. I love technology. I don't know if we actually perish. We might actually perish. I might actually lose my stuff. Fuck. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Just in case this actually does do us in. It does. I kind of figured it did. Alright. <laughs> Semi-Neon has ended his biological existence. That is one way of saying, uh, you know, a Walmart... Walmarting yourself. Anyway, I was afraid that was going to happen. And I, honestly, I don't know if everything's actually saved where it should be. Alright, so we got a lot of things here now. We got the yellow pill, which actually is used to reset all unlocked Android abilities. Well, if you look at us... Or, well, I have a cape on. Here, give me one second here. Interesting. Apparently I can't even see my own spine. But there theoretically would be a spine there. Or maybe it's actually implanted in the body. Ah. Let me see. You can actually trade with him too. Oh, he's a nitwit. Look at this idiot. Alright, anyway, regardless. As you can see, we have a little uh, H, um, a HUD now. So you can actually see our uh, battery percentage, our health, and I think our movement speed, which is pretty cool. And we can select upgrades if we want to. Or if we find more parts, like let's say if I find this, this, or this, or along the road here, I can actually put those on as well. You see that? Just slap that there. Sloppy arm there that there 
And I can even upgrade my battery if I wanted to. We can go ahead and actually... I'm going to actually do that. I want to be a high-capacity android, you know what I'm saying? All right, other. And we need our spine, which we have right here. That's why it didn't show up, because we didn't it actually put it in our body yet. There we go. Well, it's still not there. That's pretty interesting. Pretty sure. Okay. Well, anyway, there's a lot of stuff we can pick here. So we can choose wireless charger. Unfortunately, we don't have XP for anything, so I'm going to have to get some bottles real quick. I figured it's actually... Okay, uh, regardless. So I figured out that it'd probably be easier to just go slash give XP. I forgot how to actually use this. There we go. We gave ourselves a absurd amount of XP, so I can show you the tech tree here. So anyway, we can do we can unlock certain things like wireless charging, which will now give us the ability to be charged by these things here. But we're already charged up, so we're we actually don't have to worry about that. Zero calories. So this right here removes the the uh, necessary... Removes the, like, you know, need for eating, which would actually be pretty nice. <laughs> Alright, then we have these repo, uh, repo sites or whatever, which removes the need for oxygen, so you don't even have to breathe anymore. <clears throat> uh, mind you, you have to be careful what kind of uh, things you pick up here, because, like, if you pick up one thing you might not be able to use something else. There's a lot of stuff here. Limb overclocking. What the heck is going on right now? Oh, that's a zombie. Okay. <laughs> well, I, I caught me off guard in a way that I could not ever fathom. We could have step assist. Really cool stuff here. So we could do a plasma shield. So all right. So if we pick nanobots, that will heal us up here. And you can either choose attack boost, but that would um that would lock this then, or you could use this, but that would lock this. A lot of complicated stuff here. Man, I kind of want to try both of them, but we can only try one at a time. Do you want screw it? We're going to go with the attack here. See, as you can see, though, that locked that up. Foul ash cooling. So we have to, we can actually upgrade these right here. And that will, if we upgrade to a certain level, then it will up, allow us to use that. And that. We'll throw ourselves some night vision to limb overclocking, which actually wakes us go faster, apparently. You open unlock that enough. Then that will also give us speed here. So apparently we're gonna be super fast. I do not wait well, I feel slightly faster, I guess. There's a lot of stuff here though. That's Step assist, item magnet. Yeah, we could pick so many things right now. Mini map to the H, uh, the HUD. We did give ourselves airbags so we could like walk on water. High jump too. Piston. Where's the piston? Hmm. Interesting. Weird. I can't find that one thing that I need now. That's weird. Well, regardless, um, because that is that, right? <laughs> weird. Well, that's something. At least we upgraded ourselves as much as possible. Now we can grab some weapons. All right, so my favorite thing here is the Ion Sniper, but we're going to go ahead and review them all here. Oops, I just tossed a battery in there, didn't I? Now, these have many modifications that you can add. 
Though, first things first, I'm going to use the hollow sights here. Uh, we're going to start off with the phaser rifle, because that's the most common thing. So this right here is the scope. She does not fit in there, apparently. So that goes there. And I have no idea what this is actually for, then, because this actually cannot go anywhere. <laughs> Funny. All right, so we can use that, right? So we, then we pick this up, and it'll actually give us the scope. See that? It gives us that little triangle there. That's pretty cool. Oh, you know what? Duh. That's actually a component. That's not a... <laughs> Duh. So if you want to change that out, you could actually go for this one. Pretty exciting stuff. See? Now that's changed it, right? See where I'm going with this? If you don't want that, like, you say that's taking too much of your vision or whatever. You can even go with this little dot here. I don't know which one I prefer the most. Honestly, I like the triangle one. I'm pretty basic, though. Alright, anyway, we also got other upgrades, like our regenerative converter, which actually heals you. So if you're shooting something that's shooting at you, then that will heal you up. Which is pretty nice. So let's say I spawned in a rogue android, right? You shoot at me, right? Hi. Oh, you know what? Duh. It's not going to shoot at me anymore because we're like, we're like literally brothers now, right? Like, that's, that's literally my family member at this point. Oh, son of a biscuit. You know, that makes so much sense. Like, that actually makes so much sense because you wouldn't shoot at your own family member. How does this not work? Oh, you know what? I think that is just for the Omni tool. Oh, this is what happens when I don't script stuff. So much sense. That's totally. Maybe it doesn't work for anything. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's what it works for. The phaser. Well, that sucks now, because, like. We could, add, we could do the mutant scientist. That does not sound right. So, all right, so it'll, it'll give us damage, right? So, we're going to hit him, right? You see, it's healing us up, right? He's like a gnarly looking guy. Hey, 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 come on now. Okay, I backed myself into a corner. That's my own stupidity there. You see that? That heals us up. Kind of gives it a per- Ah. Uh, this say like kind of gives us a purpose, but it, it, it really doesn't. That scientist is strong. Holy crap. Well, we're going inside. Screw that guy. Okay, well, the phaser is honestly kind of one of the most disappointing weapons in the mod, in my opinion. <laughs> oh, fuck, I wish I was a robot now. Keep sneezing. Alright, now, anyway, there's a lot of other... This here is actually for our Omni tool, which actually makes breaking blocks a little quicker. So, right now, see, that takes a decent amount of time, right? I think that was quick, right? Throw this in here. It's going to be a little quicker. Look at that. Beautiful. Honestly, I love the Omni tool because it's actually such a nice tool to use. Like, it's actually fun to use this. Like, who doesn't want to use a little laser to mine stuff instead of, like, using a pickaxe? Like, come on. Using a pickaxe is, like, so, like, 18th century, like... <laughs> Look at me, I'm going down to the coal mines. Ah, but you got this now. And it shoots things as well. Like, isn't that pretty cool? I mean, mind you, that's this is not the best weapon. But, like, you can also, you can also change colors on any of the weapons that you have. So this I could make blue if I wanted to. And you also, of course, can upgrade the battery. Always high, always high capacity. Also, you have some like miscellaneous spots here where you could add other stuff if you wanted to. Why did that not work for that? Hold on. Wait, see, it's blue in there. Oh, it just doesn't change in the thing. That's right. Okay. And now it makes your laser bleed be blue too. <laughs> this is actually really freaking neat. 
All right, the one thing I've been wanting to try is the degenerative explosive focusing matrix. I'm going to try this on the sniper rifle or the iron sniper. Wait, wait, wait. I want to kit this out, actually. If there's one thing I want to kit out today, I want to smack everything I got into this and we're going to make it uh, sky blue. Actually, you know what? Make it red. All right, so we're going to smack that in there, smack that in there. We can smack that in there as well. A little bit of this. Oh, yeah, it doesn't fit in there. What does that go to? Oh, you know what? Probably goes to the shotgun. Duh. Yep, it does. Oh, yeah, that makes some, that makes actually sense now. So this actually... Oh, yeah, I'm not going to shoot that inside. That's going to put a hole in stuff here, no doubt. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we're going to use the incendiary filter then for that. Take off these guys here. So we're going to use our iron sm ion smelter. Oh, what the heck? Maybe the or original the lithium. What works for this, actually? Like, I'm curious now. I don't think any of these work for this. That's so fr it's so sad. Oh no. That's like actually disappointing. None of these modules actually work for this. I guess since it's already, I guess, overpowered enough. <sighs> Dang, son. You can add this to everything else, though. You could add that to the freaking. Oh my, you could add that to the plasma rifle. Get any of this, except for the venom. Huh. Add that too. A little bit of batteries. Should we give it a, a whatchamacallit? Yeah, we're gonna give that blue. We'll give it a scope too. There we go. That looks pretty cool, actually. Alright, now we got a little bit of friends outside. Now we gotta show these off. I'm very sorry, dear Android brother, but I'm gonna have to do this. It's for YouTube. Alright, so anyway. We use our phaser rifle for this, or we could just take him out like this. I kind of like the red aesthetic on that. That is pretty cool. I'm so sorry, brother. Okay, he does shoot you when you shoot at him. Yep, man. I'm, I think I'm actually burning. <laughs> oh, this is not very good. Uh, I, don't, I don't think I can be in the water either. Oh, you can actually see how much health he has now. I gotta use this. Oh, that's pretty cool. I actually kind of like that. Yep, I'm so sorry, dear brother. All right, so you got a chance to actually get a legendary wife, uh, rifle. Actually, so this actually is, could have like any sort of uh, anything that makes it better than the stock rifle that we just cobbled together. So we're going to compare it in the table here. All right, so this, for example, has the incinerator filter. The battery sucks, though. But as you can see... Oh, wait, hold on. Hold up. I think I actually might have accidentally made a better weapon. Okay. Whoa, that's just embarrassing, isn't it? You didn't have a good weapon, even. You just set me on fire. They could also drop legendary parts, though that's less common. Alright, I gotta get some more androids. Alright, next we have the uh, legendary tall guy. Which, this guy just... Oh, you little freak. This guy has nothing, like, he's a melee android, so like... He just punches you. He can get close enough to you. Poor chappy, he's done now. And he has a, could have the possibility of dropping a legendary thing like this legendary leg here. Which actually would be a pretty good thing to have. So I think I might actually like install that. I never noticed, but like my parts are up there now. Has that always been like that or am I just like... <sighs> just stupid. So we can see this leg here. 
garbage. Give me that good leg. Yes, sir. We have a good leg now. <laughs> I love that. That's fun. And then we have the regular size androids, which are just not really as exciting, really. See, I could just, you know, take them out. Okay, come on. We'll do this, Robbie. Where did you go? That little sneaky bastard. How many bucks you got? Oh, he's right there. I my aim is not really good. I'll say if you need to reload any of your weapons, you simply just like. Oh crap! Oh crap! I think I might actually be stuck down here. <laughs> oh no! If you take the blue pill, then you return to a human. There you go. I'm so glad I had that in my inventory. <laughs> oh, lordy. And that means we have to deal with the android that's inside of our health. What up? Oh, fuck. Fuck okay. You freaking robot. Okay, I might actually die in here. You little freaking jerk. Well, okay, well, this video has d just devolved into shambles now. <laughs> Surprisingly enough. I Somehow, that's what happens when you don't script stuff. Oh, I just shot it. I just shot the scientist, man. It just has definitely devolved into insanity. Okay, I'm listen, bro. I'm trying to become an android again. Just let me take this pill here. There you go. And that is how you become an android without needing the scientist man. I don't think you can actually craft this, though. Let's take a look-see here. Okay, you can find them in dungeons, though. So you can actually find one of these. Stalling drivers. Adjusting artificial limbs. Heck yeah. Transformation in progress. Notice how the android's not attacking us anymore, though. So my neon has ended his biological existence. I am now I am now a computer. Beep. I like to pretend I'm a uh, you know a printer. <laughs> I love this. I love the I love these weapons. They're like actually my favorite. This one's got the kind of speed going on here. So anyway, that is oh, don't you love that? Well, look at that. Okay, well, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is it from me. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.